Yeah? Oh, man. Wow. Oh, my God. Apparently, there's lots. Yeah. Apparently, there's lots in there. That's how there's stupid lot. we are. <laughs> I didn't even look at it. They bombarded me. <laughs> yeah, because we literally saw them toss it in. We're like, so you know what the bingo ball is. <laughs> this close to my damn face. <laughs> oh, my God. So, you know... <laughs> So did they beat anything? <laughs> Why do I think it must be a comp or something? Because if it was like a special veto or something, they would let you keep them. Yeah. That's why I'm like, it has to That's be like... That's true. And if like, there's so many of them too. Then like, yeah, I we, think we found like 20. Oh. <laughs> like, I don't know if that other dark going to be suitcase thing. Bowl. Like if they're going to be like <laughs> bingo. <laughs> yeah. To literally match it. Like, and here okay. there's going to be bingo sheets at some point. Damn. Yes, our theme is like when, we saw the, when we saw the bingo game, we both were like, oh my god, this is Yeah, that's what we thought. <laughs> like when we were upstairs waiting, I was like, oh my god. Oh, well, I'm going to be looking for a secret POV all week. I'm going to be grinding. <sighs> there's going to be like, some sort of twist this week or next week. I, so. I, I think there's got to be a twist. Like, this is, not, this is not a mistake. I don't know, though. I think it could be. Just too obvious? Thank you. The TikTok wall. That she doesn't black out. Isn't that just too obvious? We went and clicked the TikTok wall and turned it like, oh, she went straight back then. Her name's like, (laughs) black out. I guess, unless the third and fourth of the D's are. What's going on? Come back to be team (laughs) captains. Like, imagine, like. Mm, Maybe. (laughs) Why then? That makes no sense. Why third and fourth? I don't know. Anyway, what a dumb move. Looks stupid. Okay, so there's there's this like five percent chance that this is just a smoke screen for a bigger play. Five percent. Why only five? It seems unlikely. I hate that guy. <laughs> yeah. It just it's just like some of the things he says puzzle me. I don't know if he's just like saying this to like throw me for a loop, but like two of the things that he said in our conversation was open to a back door. And I don't want either one of you to go home this week. Mm-hmm. Two of those things were not needed to be said in the conversation. He didn't need to say any of those things. Of course. The other thing was I went up to him and I, after the knob ceremony, just to give him a handshake. And he said, go in that POV. Is that just something that you say? Or is that, mm. some, or is that something Big that code, was yeah. meaningful? I'm just... I think it's extremely unlikely. I'm just playing out all scenarios because two of us on the block. Keep it down. Every what time. the fuck's going on? It's bananas. Two of us on the on. block is like, oh, is that just two? That's like too emotional. And Kiefer knows this game. Yeah, that's fair. Like he's a fan of this game. And you're going to tell me he's making an emotional decision from seven days ago to put us on the block when he knows damn well if we won, we wouldn't have put him on the block. The part that made me laugh was just his whole speech. When he was like such being such a baby about what Jed said in mm-hmm. his speech. Mm-hmm. And then you say that, like I was actually laughing at the end. Mm-hmm. Do you hear me laugh? I saw you. I was, yeah, like, I was Jesus. Like, Cause I was like upset that you guys were up there, then I saw you starting to laugh and I was like, Still Me, I was like I was well, like, it's I so hypocritical. Like, like you're such laugh. a piece of shit, dude. Pick pick a pick something. You can't just say you're respectful and make it true. I do think that it's just, like, funny how he, like, preaches respect and, like, all the good things in life. And then, you know, after, even after the flip last week where he almost voted to evict me, he was, like, talking about Stu and I. And we got that from a credible source who was Tina. Mm -hmm. Like Which, he's gonna try to hide it for a second. He's like, "Fuck I it." I, just, I never know who I'm talking to anymore. Like, I'm just like, "Holy fuck!" Like, who was Tina? Because I've, I've never. I get so scared now about things that I say. I just oh, like, same. I'm just like, who? Like, who's in the room with me? Um, so Tina comes up to me and tells me after the flip that Kiefer's still saying that I'm going after Tina and Tara, and then Stu's going after the girls. And, yeah. So it's just funny how like Kiefer can like talk about stuff. And continue to try to play both sides, but then he I'm wants to preach. Weird. Then he wants to like preach respect. And I can't stand him. No, I don't mean either. And it's just like baffles me how he's such a fan of this game, and he would make a move that's so emotional. Like we have well, the like numbers. Not a move at all. It's just. Like, and if you want to play the emotional thing, like we we kept you here. Yeah. You should feel more emotionally betrayed by the people that were sad that you were, you were still here. Yeah. 
until you won. But whatever. It is what yeah. it is. Well, we're going to talk to him tomorrow before yeah. POV. Yeah, yeah so yeah, let's, yeah. let's chat. There. So before POV... So basically, you guys are gonna go in and you're gonna be Same like, that, yeah, be like, oh, thanks like, for not putting us up. Thanks for keeping true to your word, like, blah blah blah. Like in the upcoming weeks or like moving forward, like, you know, I'd love to work with you, Kiefer. You know how mm-hmm. I feel, and like, I know mm-hmm. Austin's really like respects and like is really thankful for you, like keeping your word as well. Mm-hmm. And then I'll be like, before the POV, like, what is your plan? Like, mm-hmm. if I get picked to play, like, what, like, do you want me to gun for it? Mm-hmm. If I do win, like, do you want me to use it? Mm-hmm. Do you, think, like, do you think Brayden should go in or should we go in together? Um, good question. I don't. I don't know if I if there's an obvious answer. What? So are you guys gonna pitch like to work together? Yeah, like I was gonna like pitch, but I keep like I know that like like we're always on the outs and it's time you know that we finally be on the ends you know yeah, blah, blah 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 like okay. both I'm really thankful together. for you and I know that Austin you know maybe we just both go in together then yeah you might as well cause then it's like if you're waiting Which for Austin to come in at like the right time and maybe she misses the time frame or something like that like yeah let's just go into it so God, it's gonna be amazing and then it'd be amazing if both of us did this well week. this is the best I would put so him up just so we can rip up. This is the other thing now. If and I get house guest choice, so that it could yeah, like do you pick one of us to play? Do you pick? <laughs> do I pick one? Of, like if we get house guest choice after that conversation, obviously we're gonna have to talk after that conversation. Yeah. Do we pick you in that scenario? I mean, it's gonna guess depend on what he says. I think like the only thing that you guys probably could pick me. Yeah. And be like, you haven't played yet. Yeah. I want you to play in one. Mm-hmm. Or, like, all day tomorrow, I'll be like, I hope I get to play in the veto. I hope I get to play in the veto. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, someone, please pick mm-hmm. me. Do you know what I mean? And then if you get it, be like, whatever, Brain, you can play. Mm-hmm. How does the uh, how does the order go? So does HOH draw first? Yeah. HOH draws first, then mm-hmm. then us two. I think he goes left, right, I think. Well, I mean, if, like, by God's grace, he draws, like, one of you, and then... Tina, Tara, and then it doesn't really matter who we pick because yeah. we'll just say like just fucking throw. It. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 100 percent. Oh yeah, easy. Or, I mean, I guess that depends on how your conversation goes with Kiefer. Mm-hmm. If, I if just can't like, see him being like because he, yeah. I just can't see him being like oh throw it, or I just can't see him being like don't use it. Because we don't. Yeah. I think we can be cryptic. Yeah. You'd be like, well, I'm not too sure if I want you to use it yet, but definitely gun for it, Brain, if you get picked. And, you know, we can have a chat after. I feel like it's what he's going to fucking say to me. Mm-hmm. Do you think he would ever put you up? I don't no. know. I, don't I, thought I, was, so. I was saying that's what I was worried with her, is that if he, like, like what, like, let's say, like, his plan is really to just backdoor her, and then I win, he's like, yeah, yeah, use it. Like, yeah. I'll backdoor tie. Yeah. And then I fucking use it, and then he puts her up. I'll look yeah. like an idiot. Yeah. No, yeah. That's why I think it's important to, like, well, want to work with them. even if that happens, yeah. even if that happens, say that exact scenario happened, I think Austin even stays against one of us, so. I don't know, though, because Brad will literally be like, get rid of Austin. That's a big move. She's already won HOH once. She almost won again. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, also Ty said he wants to talk to me. I don't know what he wants to talk about. What's that? Ty said he wants to talk to me. I don't know what he wants to talk about. Did we talk ever find out what he talked to Tara about? No. He was it was like, basically Tara saying that Tara pulled him because Tara wanted, oh, and Jed too, because she wanted to like provide them reasons of yeah. why she voted to Vic Latoya when she oh. found out, so the timing. So now all six of the stories match up. Mm. Um, Hold on, Tara. And I don't know why the conversation went for like an hour, but I guess it was just her like letting them know. Yeah. Because he, like, at dinner, he was like, can I talk to you later? I was like, yeah, sure. Like, I literally don't know what it's about. And I don't know if he wants to ask me, because I know Judd talked to me about what happened. I don't know if he wants me to tell him what happened. I don't know. Or if he, like, just wants to know, like, what's going on. I have no idea. So do you think there's a plan in, in place to backdoor Vic, is my other question? With me to backdoor, know. though. That's <laughs> what she... Did she... Remember what she was saying? Isn't involved with it? Mm-hmm. He's like, she's like, it's got to be... It's got to be a bigger move than this. It's... God wanted to backdoor me. <laughs> I just don't understand. Like, Relax. Well, I would, yeah, that's, if he wanted her out, he, that's what I told her. I said he would have just put you up. But, like, just to entertain all ideas. Ideally, 
a backdoor of Beth would be phenomenal. But that's what I wonder. And also because I think the boys are kind of iffy with her. That they might you do be think like, that? Yeah. <laughs> so what, what's giving you that? I, I thought I think that as well. But like, what's giving you that impression? Just like whenever they like talk, they like it's, never it's in, a, include her. Well, Tita Terry, the first. Do we, we told you about the untouchables choice. thing, right? Would you rather yeah. Ask yeah. That. yeah. And then he was like telling me because I was like, yeah, like we were just like really torn off the last minute, blah 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 blah. And then he's like, well, like. I don't know if you guys are working with Kyle and Rowe, working mm-hmm. with Tina yeah, Tara, whatever, blah, 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 like that very first day, well, yeah. like mm-hmm. yesterday. Mm-hmm. He's, like, but he's like, me, Kai, and LaToya, like, yeah. we're three that would never flip on each other, and like, you guys should want to come work with us. Now, once, did he say bye? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Who hasn't so I was like, like oh. Yeah. And then I think to her, he, he told like her, that? like, I want to work with, like, Kevin you, wanted to go Braden, Braden Tara. Rowe. Uh, Kyle and then me and Ty. Fucking show like, why are you not coming back? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, like at all. Okay, well that's good. I don't know if there's like feel iffy about him. They just wanted to go. Mm-hmm. Or I don't know if, if that's what Ty wants to ask me about. Mm-hmm. Be like, so did Beth like see out? Is that yeah, true? Yeah, just make it seem mm-hmm. like she's big. I don't know. Austin. No. <laughs> okay. So I'm not too sure. Okay, so it's a possibility then. Yeah. Big. Do you want me to so if you guys, if your conversation goes well with Kiefer tomorrow, pre POV, and you establish some credibility with him, like or like this true person, person you two want to work whatever, pseudo yeah. alliance or whatever it's going to be, there's no way he puts either of you up because there's no way he has anyone else. Then if one of us wins, mm-hmm. or you win, or yeah. she wins, so then we can float Beth. Yeah, of course. I'll persuade. Okay. Man, Carb is in a tricky spot. I think that's huh? the best case scenario. Oh, and then I can even talk to the boy. <laughs> Carbs are hurting. Carbs are hurting. Like, Fucking game. game. Like, well, that would actually be good. Like, oh, whoever, or maybe Austin, because huh? they told yeah. her that they, want they wanted a six spinal six. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe she can go up to him in that scenario yeah. and be like, yeah. Yeah. wondering, like, what did she do? Or because if you guys want final six, then one of them should come down, right? Exactly. We are just saying that if, like, one of you win the veto, for example, like, in that scenario, you could go to the boys and be like, you know, should what should, like, what should I do? Someone? Like, is that something we should do? Because they're the ones that came to you and said, final six, right? Mm-hmm. And they're like, yeah, use it. What's so that? it'll be a good tell from them, too. And honestly, if you use it on one of us and you're scared of, like, one of you other two going home, you know what? We'll, we'll just fucking blow up our own game at that point Shut if it backfires. Up. Stop. <laughs> What's your, but, but it's like either, you know what I mean? That'd be the only chance. So if he did try to blindside, like Braden uses it, puts up Austin, and it's against Roe, or it's against me, we'll just fucking combust. Stop. <laughs> me, I already said I would literally, I would go off on Keith, like I would rip a strip off of them. Yeah, and then we'll just combust. <laughs> and I'd be sobbing. <laughs> you just go fucking lay in the ball. I would go Roe times 100. <sighs> yes. <laughs> like I'd be like, oh, you want to be intimidated, Kiefer? <laughs> That's what I, man, I was going off in that ball pit for a while. My live feeds might be, might be yeah, like not like I'm going back. Right I'm now. going back to tomorrow morning. To the pit? No, to oh, to <laughs> let my thoughts be heard. Because I was just like, I need to go to sleep. I'll come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. Well, sounds like a plan, Sam. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. Keep us posted. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Try. Thanks to make for going to bat for us. Thanks yeah. for going to too bad for us. Try to yes. make them believe that you actually want to work with them, like yeah. real bad. We love carbs. Come on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Come on. All right. We do love carbs. We'll uh, we'll stagger the yeah. exit here, but sounds good. We'll, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. tomorrow. Asking me what, what we're gonna do. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Are, are you sleeping in uh, Destiny? Yeah, of course. Okay. There's somebody behind the door. Do you see?